Does anyone know what that is? They are recyclables. Recyclables are waste materials from our homes that can be remade into new things. Let's head into the recycling center. My friend Jean Marie will show us what they do there. Yay! Wow! Look at all these recyclables! That's right, Penny. And the exciting thing is, all these old jars, containers, and other materials are going to be made into something new. So once these objects get processed here at our plant, these piles will be gone. And we'll have room for even more recyclables. Wow, that makes me think. What would happen if all this stuff wasn't recycled? What would happen if you never picked up the dirty clothes in your room? They'd be everywhere! I wouldn't have anything to wear. That's right. By helping your mom and dad pick up your clothes, you are making sure that you have a nice, clean room to sleep and play in. Also, your clothes are being washed and reused. And our planet is the same way. If we keep things tidy and recycle, we will have more space to live. And we can reuse materials instead of letting them clutter up the planet. So, what is one way to make sure that animals have a place to sleep and clean water to drink? Recycle! That's great! Helping the planet can be so easy. Sure can. Now, let's see how we can get these recyclables sorted and sent on their way. Sounds great. And away it goes. As this trash makes its way through the sorting system, it will be divided into materials that are alike. These materials are all separated into groups. What is the same about these objects? They're all made of plastic. That's correct. They're all made of plastic. Great comparison. The recyclable plastic and cans are separated from the trash. How can they think that fast? We have to be very good at finding things that are alike and grouping them together. For instance, can you tell which one of these is plastic and which one is aluminum? Which one do you think is plastic? Data! And which one is aluminum? Data! We could have this gang working here in no time. In order to find out how we separate the cans, we have to move a little bit further down the line. Do you notice anything interesting about how the trash falls into the chutes? The cans fall further. Yes, this machine sorts the cans by itself. And what is the end result of all this sorting and comparison? Let me show you. Wow, look at that. Do you notice anything about this bale of materials? They're all made of plastic. And what about this one? They're all made of paper. Very good. This bale of paper, when it's recycled, is equal to 17 trees. It's because we know how to sort and compare that we can make this happen. Plastic, glass, and aluminum can be recycled indefinitely. You never have to throw them away. Yes, and because of recycling, these containers can be remade into a new useful item. The journey of recyclable materials is made possible with modern day technology. What different pieces of equipment helped them along their way today? How did the recyclables get to the recycling plant? A big truck is a monster truck. Right, a truck brought the recyclables and then we pushed them into a pile. With what? Bulldozer. Yes, just think about how much more work one person can do with tools like that. And then the conveyor belts help with the sorting process. 
What was your favorite part of the field trip? That one that bunched them all together. Does anybody know how it works? It's pushing! It's pushing it! Yes, tools like that make hard jobs easier. Oh, here comes the truck to take away our sorted recyclables and turn them into something new. That's it. Away she goes. What do you think it will come back as? A car. That's a great answer. Perhaps different parts of the car. It is amazing the things that we can do with technology. What else might it come back as? Water bottle or container. That's right. It can come back as anything. And speaking of juice containers, I think we're ready for a break. Would you children like a snack? Yeah! Wow, you children were hungry. Now that we're finished, what do you say we clean up? I'm so proud of you. You recycled your plastic bottle. I have a glass container. And what can you do with that? Recycle it. Yes, great idea. I have a glass container too. Great, let me see you in action too. Hooray, I'm so proud of you. You made your own decisions to recycle today. Great job. And you even knew the right container to place it in. So, why did you recycle today? It keeps the earth clean. We can reuse it to make something new. Outside animals. And now, you all know how easy it is to make a difference and protect our planet. Yeah! Jean Marie, our kids just cleaned up and recycled on their own. That's great. I'm glad you had a good time here today. Thank you, Jean Marie. We had a great time today touring your center and learning how to help. All right, kids. Bye. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye. 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 Bye.